How to handle an adventurous toddler. One actress has the mommy verse buzzing with a People Magazine blog post about her decision to stop telling her daughter no. ABC's Abby Boudreau has the story. No. It's a two letter word. No. Most toddlers know all too well. No, 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 no. Never did I think I would tell my precious baby no. No. But now it feels like that's all I say. No, 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 no. First time mom and actress Marla Sokoloff, who's appeared in Desperate parents. Housewives and Full House, oh, is trying what something mean? most parents wouldn't Woo! dare. You try not to say no. Yes, I just felt like that evil mom who was just always reprimanding my child, and I hated myself and my parenting skills, and I think she was starting to not like me. Marla says her 15-month-old daughter, Elliot, got so used to hearing no, she thought it was funny. <laughs> it got to the point where she was literally laughing in my face. <laughs> my nose can turn into no, 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 like that. Yeah, my <laughs> husband, that, that used to be his no. When we first started, he'd be like, no, 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 no. But none of those no's were working, so she turned to extreme extreme measures and stopped saying no most of the time. Some experts say it helps. It's an absolutely wonderful idea because if you're saying no all the time, your toddler is not going to take you seriously. Here's how it works. Instead of saying no to everything, you pick three non-negotiable no's. For Marla, standing in the bathtub is a big no-no. Same thing for throwing food from the high chair and trying to eat their dog's food. The rest of the time, she relies on the art of distraction. And of course, there's always the look. Do you still give her the no look? And you know what I'm talking about. I do. <laughs> Could this be the answer for all of us moms who are tired of sounding like a broken record? No, no, no. I feel better about myself as a mom. But don't expect little Elliot to stop saying that two letter word anytime soon. For Good Morning America, Abby Boudreaux. No, 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 no. ABC News, Los Angeles. Okay, sparking some debate here. Let's bring in parenting expert Dr. Jared Gordon. No, 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 Oh, no, no, no. yeah, right. <laughs> oh, it's so interesting, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, to me, I think, like, what is going on? Like, the, the word no is so important on so many different mm -hmm. levels. Mm -hmm. You know, and one of the, you know, when I speak um, all over with parent, diff different parenting experts, one of the most important things that parents say, I want my kids to be self-disciplined. So self-discipline, what's self-discipline? Self-discipline is when a person says no to themselves in the moment to focus on something else. Mm. And one of the best ways for parents to teach self-discipline is for parents to be disciplined in their parenting. Right. Well, so, and I, I think it was, you know, we heard her say, I think I, it's a trap that I yes. felt like she didn't like me. I, I, I just yes. feel like if I do a good job as a parent, my child will mm -hmm. like me when they're an adult, when mm -hmm. they can right. choose to like yes. me. Yes. Mm -hmm. And so. I think kids want boundaries. Right. Yes, and not only that, But I remember it's teaching, true. you're teaching them the word no, because of course yes. they're smiling at it when you're right. saying it at first, because they don't know what it means. Right. But they learn what no yeah. means by you being firm yeah. with them. Yes. And I just remember. And consistent. Yes. Consistent. Yes. consistent. Yeah. Very exactly. consistent. Okay, I'm going to play devil's advocate here. Go ahead. I am constantly constitutionally incapable of not saying no all the time. So <laughs> you, you I, can't I'm, say no? No, no, I say no oh. all the time, but I understand what she's talking about. Mm. If it just becomes reflexive, yes. you're saying no yeah. all day right. long. I can it takes away the meaning of it. You feel, you, right. but how does, is it because how it makes you feel? Oh, look at you. You're taking over my job. <laughs> no, no, no. I know what you're doing. I'm like, hey, wait a second. Good question. <laughs> but you know what, I absolutely, you know, you're right, because a lot of parents, they focus more, well, how does it make me feel, versus what are we trying to do? Like, what is our focus here? Yeah, yeah. As a parent, like, what is it we really want to do? And let's make sure that we are parenting according to our principles, not by emotion. Yep. Yep. All right. Yep. You're here. Yes. Uh, Karen Gordon, great to have you. Yeah. Thank you so really much for having me back. Thank you so much. <laughs>